We're standing here in the town stand of uh, Ballin Rowan, isn't that right? That's right, yes, that's it. And we're standing here by a tree that... Uh, in memory of Cathy Hansbury. And Cathy was your... Daughter. M myself and Ona. Ona's, uh, Ona's her mother's name. And Pat's my name. And Cathy passed away, didn't she? She did, yeah. She passed away last July, 12 months. Mm. July 18. And that was a big shock for you? Oh. Well, yeah, because it was a big shock for the rest of our lives, like, you know, sure. For me and Owen, it never will be the same again. The family chain is broken, like. You know, there was, there was six, we had six in family. We have uh, four, four girls and, and two boys. And, and Cathy was the second oldest and we lost her. Cathy lived at home here with you? Cathy was in the home house, in the home house. Cathy wasn't married, she was still here with mum and dad all the time, Mike. Do you know, she hadn't, she had never left, she had never left home. She was always here. And we thought that she was always going to be here, but we were wrong about that bit of it. Do you know? Your hand is resting on a fence that's guarding a tree, protecting a tree. That's right, yeah. That's we put that whole fence around it just in order to there'd be caves and he did have Martin did have caves and he'd have cows in here like, you know. We had to have something to put to guard it, like, you know, there was they wouldn't knock it over. There's no point in sewing it if she wouldn't be she wouldn't be happy with it if we let them knock it over. <laughs> she wouldn't be happy with us. <laughs> Cause us didn't get to tell them off. So it's for letting it happen. And the tree here, here beside you, you planted that when she passed away? Yeah, we planted that in two days before her month's main mass. That's when that was planted. It was planted the, of what, around the 5th or 6th of August, I'd say, in 18. You know, that's when it was, that's when it was planted. The whole family, the whole family was here, you know, the whole lot of them. And the grandchildren, they were all, they were all here, it was a big, for the grandchildren, it was a big occasion, like, you know, for them, they were all, all excited and flying around with footballs and they were very happy, like, they didn't realise what, what it was, like, you know, but so that's, isn't that life, and what can you do, you know, you play the hand you're dealt and that's it, you know, that's the way I see it. And they all call this tree Catty's tree. They all, that's it, that's, the, that's what it's called, the trees, and they'll all go out there and have a look, and they'll, they'll but no one, will, no one will go in there near or and like, you know, they'll, they'll just look at it, and they'll, they'll, there was visitors home here from, here from America, there were, there were relations of ours, and they took photographs of it, and I suppose they'll show it beyond America to people, like, you know, to, friends of ours and tell them what happened, you know. And you also planted, you said you planted some roses and tulips and daffodils, didn't you? Yeah, the, the, we put a row of tulips or daffodils all around her and we put four, there's four tulips in it as well, like, and, and the, the wild rose. <laughs> <laughs> the, don't, don't forget that lad. <laughs> <laughs> A wild rose. A wild rose. <laughs> was that a slip off one of one of Catty's? It was a slip off some, of a, a bunch of roses. She, someone brought to the house sometime with her mother or something, something, and she took a slip off on them and struck it out the back of the, the old sheds there, and it grew, started to grow. And and I took a piece off it, and I tried the same thing, and it worked. You know, it's growing away there. I don't know whether it flower or not. It may never flower, but sure, look at it. Is, it's nature, isn't it? That's the way. It, just something to to remind me of her, like, you know, when, when I'd walk out, I'd, I'd think about her. And would you look at the tree nearly every second day, I'd say? <laughs> I look at the, the tree a hundred times a day. <laughs> no, I do, but. I always say, like, I wish you'd seen it growing, like, you know what I mean? Maybe I suppose we should have maybe sown it before she passed away, but 
we we didn't do that. We we it's it's in memory of her now. That's that's why it is that's why it is there now, like. Because it was in memory of Cathy, like. And from now on it'll always be known as Cathy's three. Yeah, it'll, it'll never always be known as that forever until till stay there, I suppose. They tell me that it'll take it they say that they will keep going for a hundred years. I don't know if they will or not, but as I said to you before, I, 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 won't, be there. I won't be there to know. <laughs> no, I won't be there to know if others are grown or not, but should the young ones coming up behind or nieces and nephews, they'll, when they're as old as me, when they're as old as me, it'll be fairly, it'll be fairly well on then. <laughs> they look after her. Yeah. <clears throat> Thanks a million, Pat. That's all right. You're very welcome.